everyone and welcome to 10 Reasons... Hang on a sec. I'm so hungry today, it's crazy. Okay. Welcome to 10 Reasons Why. So this week I'm going to be using a new pretend boyfriend. Because you know what? I wanted a change and no one else was around. And my friend George begged me for days to be in this video. Whoa, what, what are you doing? Please, please let me be in the shower, please. Please let me be in the show. So basically, after all that, I decided to give him a chance. Um, I think he's pretty happy. Woo! Woo! Yeah! All right! Yeah! Woo! Woo! So last week, I likened women to dogs because I am a bitch. Oh, see what I did there? Did ya? Did ya? Oh my god, I want to slap myself in the face. So this week, I'm going to be attacking the men and give you 10 reasons why a dog is better than a man. I did try and use a real dog in this video, but it didn't go very well when I tried to film him. Uh, he does not stop smelling my bum, by the way. That is all I have to say. <laughs> He's obsessed with smelling my ass. Aren't you, little dog pervert? One, dogs don't have a problem expressing affection in public. Men often do have a problem with this. I have had a boyfriend before who wouldn't hold my hand in public. I think he was ashamed. Yeah, let's not dwell on that. Mm, two? Dogs don't feel threatened by a woman's intelligence. Quite like to go to New Zealand, see the kangaroos. <laughs> kangaroos are in Australia, you bellend. You've got small tits. Three? You cannot make a man do this. Stay, sit, and roll over. Four? Dogs don't care if you've put on a few pounds. Why am I saying prounds? Dogs don't care if you've put on a few pounds. Sometimes shit happens. The fish salad, I really like. So it's not called fish salad. What are you looking at? Sure, sure, Nothing. Sure. Menu, I, I can feel you looking at me. What? I would avoid herring, but... Do you put on a bit of weight? Five! Dogs will never complain about what you give them to eat. They'll just eat what they're given. Hi, babe. Hi. How you doing? Oh, Good day. fine. I've been, oh, I've been slaving away in the kitchen all day. Yeah. I hope you like it. Yeah. What the fuck is that? Don't know why I bother. Six. Dogs have the ability somehow to know when you're a bit sad or you want some attention. Sometimes guys are a little slow on the uptake. Oh, yeah, that one? Okay. Hey, Dominic. Cheers. Let's put football on, yeah? Cheers. You alright? Seven. Dogs don't notice your bad breath in the morning. <sighs> Oh, oh. Eight. The worst social disease you can get from a dog is fleas. This isn't quite the same with men. You've given me what? And also to confirm I don't actually have a sexually transmitted disease. Nine. Dogs are very loyal creatures and will always be by your side when you need them. Sometimes men stray. Yes, yeah, so I was thinking we could, uh, what can we do tonight? But don't worry ladies, this is easily rectifiable. Come on. Come on, he's a good boy. And ten. Dogs can get possessive, but in a healthy way. Sometimes men can get really obsessive to the point of stalking, to the point of restraining order. Her, what the fuck? Fuck, George! How am I going to wear tonight? I just don't know. What the fuck? You didn't fuck? tell me you were going out. And now it is time for the top comments section of the show. One. Thumbs up if you agree that Emily should record in HD. I thumbs up it. I just can't afford it. Two, I like unicorns that eat potatoes. I love your vids. Okay, second part, uh, thank you. First part, what? Three, I don't even know why I am subscribed. She has never made me laugh. There's an unsubscribe button, right? Press it. Right, so my favorite top comment this week is from someone called, I always have to look right because I don't remember their names, Rhymes Boxer. He or she said, great video, Emily. I think you are damn hot and perfect. Just hoping I'd find girlfriend like you are. I mean, you are good looking, not good looking. Actually, you are looking perfect. I haven't read this through, actually. Um, I think I fell in love with you. Ha ha. Cheers from Croatia. Now, I know a lot of you think I'm using this new section because I want compliments and for people to say things nice about me. Yes, I do. When you get a lot of abuse over the internet from trolls and on the Daily Mail website, it's quite nice that people take the time to write nice things. Besides, you're a wanker and um, I hate you. 
Okay, so as some of you know, I've stopped doing the pyjama dance so much. Mainly because my friends laugh at me. But considering I have actually got pyjamas on now, I'm gonna do one. Pajama dance, pajama dance, pajama dance, pajama dance, pajama dance. Fuck you friends if you're laughing at me. Now it's time for the outtakes because I love them. I love them. George is being very unprofessional. <laughs> He's answered the phone whilst we're recording. Yeah. Like a bell end. <laughs> there you go. That's rubbish. Yeah, that? come on. Okay. Slap me. <laughs> Fucking slap me. You're a dick. Alright, this isn't a poor movie. You're a dick. Okay, wait. And why are you on my boobs? <laughs> No idea. I go to bed with every night. <laughs> Literally. You wonder why you're single. <laughs> the things, the things people do. Yeah, right. Get in the I cupboard. <laughs> Snug as a bug in a rug. I'm so getting it. Almost in like it. it was made for. I'm so getting it. This is happening. <laughs> All right. Okay, okay ready? Yeah. You're staying at my bum. No. <laughs> Off. <laughs> do it again, do it again. No, you've had enough. <laughs> Porn time's over. <laughs> We'd just like to say that was George's idea so not to smash a, one of my fucking <laughs> plates. Not one of your plates, one of my plates. It's fucking fun. Okay, so that's it for this week. Um, thank you very much for watching. I make videos every Monday because it's a shit day and we all need to laugh. I'm on Twitter at Emily Hartridge. I reply to most tweets unless you write something bitchy, then I don't. I have a Facebook group, 10 Reasons Why. That's it. Bye!